I'm Jory Jensen, baseball instructor. We're going to be talking about uh, using a no stride in hitting a baseball. Now, when we're using a no stride, that, that is something that is a personal uh, preference. Uh, a lot of hitters will do it with two strikes on them typically because they're trying to be quicker and, and put the ball in play. Um, and anytime we're hitting a baseball, it is going to be about our balance and tracking the baseball as it comes to us. Um, we're going to begin with a little bit of a wider stance uh, as we go to a no stride. Um, we're going to get our, our weight in a good position ready to hit. And as the pitch comes, we're going to use a little bit of a roll up motion. And as we roll up, we're still going to be loading our hands and loading our body as we roll up on that front foot. And you don't want to roll up too much and over twist. If you over twist, you're going to cause yourself to lose track of the baseball, uh, which obviously it's hard to hit if you can't see. Um, as we roll up, we're still going to be using a no stride roll up, still going right back into our swing, staying in control, staying balanced on that front side, finishing high, making sure that our barrel stays long through the zone and long through the baseball, therefore giving the baseball backspin and, and letting the ball travel. Um, so as we get ready to hit, it's going to be about a roll up and a balance um, as we roll up to swing all the way through the pitch. And I'm Jory Jensen, baseball instructor. We've just talked about using a no stride in hitting a baseball.